Today, Clipper and I are gonna show you three of the most important French cleats you can have in your workshop. Let's get into it. So I chose some tools that we're gonna be using all the time. I use these in the shop almost every time I'm in here. Some chisels, we got our sander and all sorts of different grits. We're gonna try and label those. Got a T-square, a speed square, and also some pencils. I always lose my pencils in the shop. For these chisels, I'm gonna do them very similar to the screwdrivers that I made last time. I'm just gonna get this extra plywood. I'm gonna mark each chisel an inch away from each other to give them a little bit of spacing. And so they're even, I'm gonna drill these holes. Then I'm gonna take it to the table saw and cut out the fronts so it has a place to slide into. And now when we make these, we wanna have protection for the front. That's why I made an extra piece, not just these two side pieces. You'll see in a second that I've got the two side pieces, the part where the chisels slide in, and then I've got a front piece right there that I'm gluing in. We wanna make sure that the chisels are always protected in the shop. Now let's put a 45 on it and let's hang her up. Next up, we got our squares and our pencils. These things are things I use every day in the shop. After I cut a piece to size, I'm just gonna mark these on end to end, just like this for both of them. That way they can slide in. I'm gonna drill holes on each side of my marks. Then I'll take my jigsaw, and cut it end to end, make it nice and square like this. And the first one fits. Now let's do one for the speed square. We're just gonna cut it end to end and it slides in nice and smooth just as well. Now we just need to cut a circle for our cup that holds our pencils. Now let's just glue it, clamp it, and it'll be ready to go as well. Lastly, we're gonna work on the sander. One thing I want for the sander is to be able to have very good access to it, but I also want shelves that I can make sure I can find a different grit really easy. One thing I hate doing is getting all my different grits out of a box and just looking for the right one. So we're gonna make multiple shelves that can hold multiple grits. So what we're doing here is we're just putting these together. I'm using each shelf as a little spacer so I can put up these walls. And then I'm gonna put the walls up and now I can put the little shelves in very easily just like this. My favorite part about this system is just how accessible it is. It's so much easier than it used to be having to take it in and out of a bag every time I use it and searching for different grits. This makes it very simple, very easy. And I love my French cleat system. If you have any ideas for future French cleats, let me know down in the comments. Let's make sure Clipper approves. He says yes. He also says if you haven't, make sure you subscribe, like, share, comment, and I'll see you in the next one.